into that jog. Go on, sis. Put it off, put it off, put it off. No, 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 no more putting it off. Gotta get in here and get something done, right? Jogging it out right now. We're gonna do 20 seconds roughly, not exact on it, but 20 seconds of high knees. Then we're gonna jog and shoulder jabs. High knees, bicep extensions while jogging. High knees, bicep extensions while jogging again. High knees, shoulder taps while jogging again. All right, then we're gonna warm up the upper body and lower body. We do that, and then we're gonna get into. This one is gonna be some of our combinements with the band and the weight. So it's with, actually with, um, you can use the extension band, the extended roll band if you want to, but it's with a booty band. You can hold a weight, put it in your foot, and pull in for the bicep curls. All right, for those single rows. So that's gonna be single rows. But first we're gonna do bicep curls. And that's gonna be standing on the long extended one. Or we can go to the ground. I'll show you how you can go to the ground and do it with the loop. Then we're gonna do single rows, wide curls on those. Then we're gonna do seated, single arm resistant row. So the band goes on the feet, pulling it back and in, but we'll also do some with just the regular weights, rowing it in and out. I'm thinking that she, I might need to grab my other 20 because I only grab my 12s and my 120. Then we're doing the T row, which is with the band, put the weight on there and T rowing it up into herself. Or you could do it with just regular weight. So all these things can do with weight, band and weight, or just in. And then it's bent over lat hold downs. So if you have something to put your band on to hold it, you would use that and you'd land over and lat pull downs that way. Otherwise, you would use the weights, bend over, pull down, and up. So you don't use really heavy weights because of the neck. Enough chit chatting. Let's get into these high knees. Three, two, one. Bring them up. Come over, stop trying to go over. Trying to get it in my own head. Come on, high knees. Get them up there. Go to a little jog in three, two, one. Jog. Arms are out there. Shoulder shot, start in three, two, one. Little jog again. Three, two, one. High knees. Three, two, one. Okay, say about 20 seconds is exact. Sometimes it's a little bit more. There is a little less room, it's a little bit more. Just depends. All right, we have bicep extensions after this one. But first we're gonna do a little jog again. Three, two, one. Get the arms out there. Three, two, one. Seven in. Bicep extensions. Warming up those arms. Jog it out, come on. And little jog, drop them down. High knees, three, two, one. Jog again. Three, two, one. Next one is bicep extensions again. Three, two, one. Three. Oh, not quite yet. Wait, where was I? Three, two, one. Jog. All right, high knees again. Then shoulder taps, and then we're getting the weights. 
three, two, one. Three, two, one. Shoulder taps. Arms are out there. Three, two, one. Three, two, and one. All right, jog it down. First thing first is bicep curls. I wish I had you could do it on the mat with the, with the single thing. Or you use weight, or you can stand like we were the other day doing this way, okay? But take a loop under your leg. It's out there. Your elbows down there. And do it on the same side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Other side. Get in there. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now, one thing you could do too is on that foot, come across. One, two, cross over curls. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. Other side again. I gotta get ten more in. Ready for it? Now it's on the resistance of that loop. Let's get tough. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now, I've never tried a wide one. I just want to see if it's going to be even feasible. Get the leg out there. Yeah, it will be. We can do them that way. Okay. So, those are the curls. Now it's the single row with the band and a weight. So, put the band on the foot. Grab it a weight. I got the 20 pounder. Putting it under the band. Not on your foot, but next to your foot to be with. Okay. You can lean over with the opposite body, opposite hand on the leg. You can pick up that weight. It's got that band on automatically. And you're going to row it. One. Put the band in the middle. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. We're switching it or switch it back again for the final. Yeah, the foot in there. You're picking at the weight. I just kind of curved my fingers around the band to keep it in the middle. And one, oh, oh, the other hand, I don't remember right hand. One, sorry about that. Two, three, I'm gonna that back straight. Four, my back was not straight, I was feeling it. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Down, switching hands. Put his under there. Reaching down to grab it. Got to fall through there. Get that back straight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten. Down, switching it out again. Other side. Get it in there. Get that out there. 
three, two, hold on, I'm on my toe. One, one, come on back, two, pull it back, three, four, five, a little slightly different angle, six, on the back, seven, eight, nine, ten, down it comes, out it goes. Okay, so wide curls. You do those with weights or the band. And I decided I should try to do it all with this. We'll see how it goes. It's on the outside now. Get that foot in here. Foot straight in. It's on the outside. And one, two, three. It's a little awkward. Try it over here. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's getting tough. We're going to keep on the same side before we switch this down, okay? Ready? Okay. I'm going to lean forward a little bit. Two. More of the lean in there. One. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. By the foot. Even those rows could have been done without the weight. So if you do a workout with just a booty band, you get a pretty good one. So three, two, one, you put the wine in there. One, two, three, four, and you get these resistance. Five that are pretty good. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Is that break? You got ten more. Get over there. Three. Oops. <laughs> two, don't take it off the motor. You're going to get through one. Foot. One. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. All right. Seated. Uh, single arm resistance. So it goes on the foot. Okay, or the feet, both of them, I think. It's gonna go on the feet. We're gonna reach in the middle. With one hand, sit up tall. Now we're gonna row it back. It's three, two, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Ten on the side. One, two, three, one, four. This is doing some five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Back to the side. And ready for it. One, sit up tall. Two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. The side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Whew, okay. Now, come on up. I definitely was feeling that back here on the back. It's time for the bent over, single row, single band. Wait, T row, okay? So, feet are gonna be in the loop. Taking that bet, wait again, whatever one you choose. I wouldn't have chose my 20. Both feet are in the loop this time, okay? So both feet are in the loop. We're gonna pick it up, twist it sideways, bend it over. Pull it in as much as you can and down again. Do the same thing with just weights. Bend over, pull them in and down. Pull them up to your chest, okay? Three, two, get over there. Back to over. One, for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Now we go. All right, nice thing we have in there. It's a bent over ladder. Hold on. So, if you have something you can live on, I actually thought about it. I was going to use my other one, but I thought, I don't know about this. We'll see. If it looks like I'm going to pull it over, I won't do it, but we'll try. So, you're supposed to be laying over it like this with one hand, and the other hand's down. Put it down. Okay, so again, let's see the angle. If I thought about pulling my pull up I'm onto myself, I'll do this. If not, I won't. We'll see. Three, two, one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Just moving it a little. Ready for it. One. Oh, no, no, no. Let's pull it here. Two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. This is a little bit more stable than pull up bar. Machine thing, off it's in it. I made a cricket. Okay, so another way of doing the lat pull downs. You can do it with one hand. One hand on it, too. Bend it over. Do yourself. Three, two, one. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. On the side, use yourself again. Arm is out there. Three, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. All right. That was working through all of the different ones. Now we're going to do them again. You can do the bands or you can do the weights this time. I'm going to do maybe a combination depending on what it is, but I'm doing weights for the bicep curls. Three, two, one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Now, I know if you're doing resistance band, you're just doing one side, you gotta do the other side. Maybe you just do ten on each side. Depending on it, but I'm trying to wait in between here too. Can't get back into it. Ten more. Three, two, one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Down it goes. The next thing we had is the single row. I'm going to go grab my heavier weight for this and the other thing. Okay, so hold on. Because I'm going to do it with the weight instead this time. And this one is the 30 pounder. Single row, whether you're doing it with the resistant band on the ground and you're rowing backwards or you're doing the bent over row here, okay? Either way, we're coming into it. Actually, this single row was with the, this one wasn't the rowing one where you're with the band, but either way, so. Single row, one arm, picking it up, let's get into this. Three, two, one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Switching sides, picking it up, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Back. Here we go. 
pick it up and one two three four five six seven eight nine ten down other side pick it up one two three four five six seven eight nine ten now let's put that row this what it is when your hawk just white curls first white curls so whether you're doing with the band or the weights white curls then we'll do our sitting row ready for them three two one two three four five six seven eight nine ten pause it down getting them both at the same time when you're doing the band you gotta do one side then you gotta do the other side Coming back into it again three two slow it down sit up tall one one two three four five six seven eight nine ten down they go now we're into the row so how do this with these 12 it's the same so with the resistance band you're with the row in pulling it in and back right so with the weights sit up tall this is where you can't use too heavy because you gotta hold them in front of you three two one one two three four five six seven eight nine ten down you feel like you're getting the back of that that's one way of doing it and again this time with the other one was with one arm so we're gonna try it with one arm and then we're gonna do the other arm okay you know what i grabbed a 10 and a 12 that means i put them away wrong i'm like how in the world do i have a 10 and a 12. that means my arms are all lopsided oh they can't hold on i had to go find my 12. hold on my nose that's all right i'm going way wrong here's my 12 one okay well one arm got it easier than the other side right okay here's the 12 that's 12 that's a 10. okay Cross body, maybe you got 12, 10 right, but it's more I want to do with this in so let me see. Cross body rows. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Whew. Definitely feel it towards the end. Feeling it in the arm and the back. Get those rows at the side. Ready for it. Three, two, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Come on. Eight, nine, ten. Down it goes. Next we have is the T row combined with weight. I'm using the heavy. 30 pounder this time instead of the 20 pounder and what wrist it's in there. T roll it. I'm gonna hold it like this way. We're gonna roll it up and down. Okay. Do 10 and then I'm gonna switch hands and do 10 more. Three, two, one, go. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Down. Switching hands. Do this again. Pick it up. It's out there. Move it over for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten. Down it goes. Okay. 
bench over, lateral, rest, pull downs, do the other thing. And twirls. Okay, so with the weight, you're up there. Okay, that's much you in. You're there, the weights are up here. You get a slight bend in there. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Differently than the shoulder presses because you're going this way, pulling back, getting those lats there. We gotta do ten more. We're we'll slow it up some, okay? Are you ready for? Put your body forward, pull it back, lean over that front leg, get them up there. And one, two, three, four, five. Switch. Now, so you don't want to activate the neck too much. It's a little break to stop that neck activation. Three, two, one, one, two, three, four, five. Down they go. It's a jog. Okay. We're jogging it. We gotta go one round of all the cardio. And then the weights one more time through. It's gonna go a little bit longer than I planned. I definitely am feeling it right for body. I don't know about you. But high knees. In three, two, one. Get them up there. Going for a jog. Three. Two, one. Next thing we have are our shoulder taps. Ready for them. Two, one. Little jog. Three, two, and one. High knees are next. Three, two, one. Get a little jog and then we're gonna do bicep extensions. Extensions. Getting them up there. Three, two, one. Three. Okay. Right. Almost. We have high knees again after these. First little job. Three, two, and one. High knees. Three, two, one. Bicep extensions again. Three, two, and one. Bicep extensions. Ready for them. Out go. And in it. Three, two, and one. High knees. Ready for it. Three. Two, one. One more round of high knees. And then another round of 
shoulder taps. Three, two, one. Shoulder taps. That's what's next. Ready for them. Here we go. Actually, no, that was it. We're ready for the weights again. I'll tap it down. All right. Okay, so, okay, this time we're gonna do one round of everything. I'm gonna drink. It's gonna be 20 ball. So I'm gonna do 10 with the band, 10 with the weights. I had to do this because then you can really feel when you're back to back where the difference is coming from. So you get in that loop. Getting it in there. I'm going to do the cross arms, I think. For these. This feels good. And then we're going to do cross up with curls for regular bicep curls, okay? Three, two, one. So that two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's put that weight. Ready for it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten. Other side. I need to break for a second. Oh, all right. Come back up. That's gonna be man first, then the weights. Okay, I'm like, what am I doing here? Man first. Get it in there. Get an arm in there. Ready for it. Cross it over. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Down it goes. Let go of it, grabbing the twelver. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10. Now, the single arm curl row that is band and then just wait, band and wait, and then just wait. So, band and wait is the 20 pounder. The just wait will be with the 30 pounder. Okay? For me. So, we're going to do uh, 10 of these. Then, we're going to go. And we're gonna do 10 with that. So we're gonna do 10, 10. I'm gonna use the, all this one first. Then I'm gonna switch over to the 30 pounder, I think. Well, no. I'm gonna have fun doing it all on one side. We're gonna do all on one side. Forget that. So we're gonna do 10, 10, 10, 10. Three, two, get up there. One, roll it up. One, hold on, I gotta get the grip right. That band. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now, come just a solid way so you feel the difference. Same thing, lift it up. One, two, and go up higher. Three, let's target just a little bit different. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Whew. Don't 
definitely felt that combination. Let's do the other side. It's down there. Get our foot in it. Put your foot in it. All right. Move over. Grab that band between those fingers just to keep it in place. It's all supposed to be not to really hold on the band. Ready? Three, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Down it goes. We got to do the ten with the thirty. Ready for it. Three, two, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Down it goes. Over there. Next thing up, wide rows. So, we do that combination again. We do, this time we're gonna do 10, 10, and then 10 together for the lines, okay? Get it out there. Hold the arm, try holding the elbow to your side of your body instead of on your leg. See how that feels, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, it's amazing, what a band, 10, can do, wow, all right, other side, again, not on the leg, on the body, get it out there, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight. and 10. Oh, wide, both of them are 12s. Three, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten. Then it goes. Okay, so the seated resistance row. I'm gonna do it with just man for. Whew. Okay, so we're gonna do. I'm actually gonna use the ten pounder this time. We're gonna do ten. We're gonna grab the weight and do ten. Then we're gonna do ten on the side. Grab the weight and do ten on the other side. Okay. Three, sit up tall, two, one, two, pull back, three, fill that, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Fill that really good right there, right? Not the weight. And out there. And one, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Down. Felt it, felt it more in the arm, too, with those. Three, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten. Down we go. Grabbing that weight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Down it goes. All right, so. 
After that, now it's the two row. With this, it's with the band and that combined, and then just the weight. So with the band combined, it's the 20 pounder. Then we're gonna switch it over to just the 30 pound weight. Okay. Feet go in it. Three. I don't know if I'm as far forward as it looks like I am. I'm right center to have that thing on there too. Right, three. Two. Pick it up. In the middle. One. Move it over. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. So how that felt. We're going for the 30. Let's see how that feels. We're going to turn it sideways too. We just had the other one, okay? This time. Three, two, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. They all, that feels just a little different on each one, right? All right, one more thing. It's the bent over lap pull down. I'm gonna do it with a hand for the one, and then the weight. Ready for it, three, two. We're gonna do 10 on, 10, 10 on one side, then 10, 10 on the other side. Three, two, one, go, one. Hold on there. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Grab the weight. I'm going to do it with a ten power. I'll try it. Ready for it. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right. So I wasn't necessarily doing bent over because I'm doing them on the floor, but same thing. We just did that arm. It's now time for this arm. Okay, up we go. Ready for it. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, grab that weight. Ready for it. And go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. Do that so I can see what the difference looks like from the back too. All right. So I did say on there you could do that pull down, or you could do upright rows, but I didn't do upright rows. That was another option for that. But this is 40 minutes in. Come out here real fast. Pull yourself back. Get that stretch. That upper body. Oh, four. Can it? Can it? Can it? And kill it. Can it? Kill it. Can it. Push that cat. Cow. Okay. More stretches are coming later. For the upper body. And more. We call this one. That's getting almost 45 minutes long. So it was definitely doozy working through everything. Get the heart rate up, <clears throat> burn some calories, and get that average heart rate. Which I do what that average was. Average was 150, and I got it up to 190. So moving through everything, kept that cardio even without the boom, hip moves in there. Going pretty good. So this one is checked off. Boom, boom, and 